So before I start this movie review, I want to give a shout out to IMDb where I get all my information and fun facts from. What's up, everyone? Movie Mania Nick here with another baseball movie review. This time, the movie is Cobb, which came out in 1994. It starred Tommy Lee Jones, Robert Wool, Lolita Davidovich, and Ned Bellamy. And the director was Ron Shelton. So this movie is basically about a reporter hired to write the official biography of Ty Cobb discovers just how dark the baseball legend's real story is. Now, I actually had to catch up on this movie in a little bit. I watched a few scenes just to, you know, remember what it was about. Because the last time I seen this movie was years and years ago. I think I was a teenager when I saw this. Um, but anyway, as I was watching it, it is a good movie. I enjoyed the film. Uh, I think Tommy Lee Jones did an excellent job as playing Ty Cobb. But there's some stuff that how this movie presents Ty Cobb. Um, now, when I was growing up, I heard all most of the stories of Ty Cobb and how bad of a play, um, player, he was a great player, but how bad of a teammate or team player he was. I mean, there's been tons of stories, but as we know, stories, they're either true stories or or just stories that drag on and get worse and worse by time. They just, you know, drag and by time it just gets ludicrous. I mean, there's stories of how much he was an a-hole to the other players, to the other teammates, to the coach. Um, but like I said, he was a hell of a player. That's why they only put up with him. Um, but anyway, yeah, then there's, a, then with this, like I said, this movie it it shows how when I think it yeah that's he starts in the beginning of the film or somewhere in the beginning he's an old man he's retired he's old and he tells this reporter of his life story and how he played and this and that and it just goes into dark stuff and really dark stuff but after a while like I said but in real life some teammates thought like that of him like how bad of a team teammate he was and a player but some people's thoughts some of the stuff in the movie didn't actually happen in real life they just made it up as a as like what movies do they over exaggerate to make the movie look better and i think this reporter did the same thing to make him look better with his book at the time but overall, it is a good film. It does tell kind of a, based on the true story or life story of Ty Cobb. Uh, us baseball fans, we know who tell Ty Cobb is and how great a baseball player was. But we heard the stories. Now, whether they're true or not, who knows? Um, but anyway, that's really all I have to say about that film. I did enjoy this film. I do recommend to see this film. If you're a Ty Cobb fan, a baseball fan, but it's probably out there on something else like Netflix, Hulu, Demand, Amazon Prime, whatever's out there, I recommend to see this film. Check it out. And now it's time for fun facts. Tommy Lee Jones had broken his leg prior to filming. He performed most of his role in a cast. The scene in the ball game was shot last when he had regained some mobility. Now, like I was saying before, much of how Cobb was portrayed in this film has now been widely recognized as inaccurate, and several serious baseball historians have labeled this film highly inaccurate. The pipe that Robert Wool smokes in the film 
was owned by the Real Al Stump. Most of the scenes filmed in a ballpark were filmed at Rick, Rickwood Field in Birmingham, Alabama. Director Ron Shelton's advice to Tommy Lee Jones was to play Cobb like Sam Peckinhall. And finally, despite how he was portrayed in the film, the real Mickey Cochran was able to manage the, the Detroit Tigers to a playoff appearance and serve in World War II. And that's it, guys. That is my movie review for Cobb, which came out in 1994. I hope you enjoyed that. As always, smash that like button, support, share, hit that notification bell, and notify you my next video or vlog will be up. And also catch me on Instagram under the same name, Movie Mania Nick. And remember, be excellent to each other. And party on, dudes!